In this video, we'll write the electron configuration for AS, that's arsenic. So to write the electron configuration, the first thing we need to do is figure out how many electrons we have for arsenic. The atomic number right here on the periodic table for arsenic is 33. That means it has 33 protons. And since it's a neutral element, doesn't have a positive or a negative here, that means the protons will equal the electrons. So we have 33 electrons for our electron configuration. You can use the diagonal rule to write the electron configuration. You have a diagram like this here and you follow the arrows. There's a link in the description how to do that, but it's probably better just to look at the periodic table broken up into blocks. We have our S block, D block, and P block. The F block would be down here. So arsenic's right here on the periodic table. So we'll just follow along and write the electron configuration. We have 1s1, 1s2, so now the S is full, can only hold two. We go 2s1, 2s2, that's full. Then we go to the P, 2p1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 2p6, and we've used 10 valence electrons. Remember, we have 33. 3s2, 3p6, 4s2, and after 4s, we go to the 3d, which can hold up to 10. So we have 3d, 10, and right now we've used 30 of these electrons. We only need three more. So after 3D, we have 4P, 1, 2, 3. There's arsenic, 4P, 3. So this is the electron configuration for arsenic. Sometimes you'll see the 3D written before the 4S. Either way, it's the same thing. When arsenic forms chemical bonds, it gains three electrons. So if it gains three electrons, it becomes AS, three minus. And it does that. It gains these three electrons in order to have a noble gas configuration. So if it gains three electrons, this three will add three here. Let's make it six. So now we have the arsenide ion, AS three minus, and it just has three more valence electrons. That fills its highest energy level, the fourth energy level, and it gives it a full outer shell, essentially. So we have the electron configuration for the arsenide ion. And then if we wanted just arsenic, we would get rid of those three electrons and we just have AS. This is Dr. B with the electron configuration for AS and AS3 minus. Thanks for watching.